Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. Now, I am probably on the late show, but I looked on the internet to see what is going on with this new zombie craze. The thing that seems to make people really act bizarre, like animals, buck naked, I mean, this is happening all across the world, is Flacca, F-L-A-K-K-A. And Flacca is causing people to aggressively attack, sometimes in a deadly force, mm -hmm. leaving carnage behind. And what you end up with is a person who can actually <clears throat> beat the door off of a car, jump on a windshield and beat it until the whole thing cracks. Beat people to death. I saw a woman trying to come out from the train. And this guy just goes and runs up after her to try to beat her down. Didn't know her from Adam. There was a young woman on a train, inside of the train, a passenger. She was, I don't know, she looked like she was Asian. And then there was another Asian man sitting down at the other end, minding his own business, trying to read his paper. And she starts lunging at him, and he gets so scared, he's, he's caught in the corner. He has nowhere to run. And she grabs his face and rears back and gets ready to punch. They didn't show that part. But can you imagine the fear, the terror that man must have felt? Then they show another man where the police have to come and rescue him because his friend, they're both high on the same stuff. His friend is literally eating his face. Just like the zombie movies. They call it the zombie drug. Ah, okay, now, here's another one. I want you to hear what this news guy says. This is why people keep talking about zombies so much. I'm really on the late show. I'm always doing these videos and barely listening to the news. Listen to this. I want you to hear. They are the walking dead. A growing drug craze is turning people like these into zombies. It's synthetic marijuana. On the street, it's called Spice or K2, and it's showing up in neighborhoods across the nation. The drug is so strong, people go into a zonked out state. Sometimes it can even turn peaceful people into crazies. Now, that's what people call getting high. Some of those people, when they come back down, if they have any kind of coherence left in them, <clears throat> have described that demons are all after them. And <clears throat> Excuse me. My point in saying all this is... When you look at Revelations and it describes the word pharmakia and it talks about it, it, it almost describes it as being a board. <coughs> it almost describes it as being a portal for the demonic. Imagine, imagine how much these street drugs are mentally and spiritually destroying people and using them to either destroy themselves or kill family members. I just got through talking about killing family members and not knowing what you did. And I found out that that flocker will cause people to do the, that very thing. One man killed his wife and his kids running around butt naked what's the thing with butt naked some of them beat their chest like apes i saw a guy chasing another man running around like an ape <clears throat> ape like characteristics and behaviorism is demonic you guys it's not a comedy it's not a fluke it's not a coincidence it is demonic many demons manifest in, in animal form, 
if a person sees in the spirit, they might see monkeys, they might see apes, they might see dogs. One woman saw a giant roach. I am telling you, when you look in the demonic realm and you see demons, they take on many forms, especially animalistic. So you have to, when you get around, if you're ever out in public, and you see somebody running around naked, you get as far away from that as you can. Because if they get their sights on you, their whole thing will be destroyed, destroyed, destroyed. It's crazy. It is, it's bizarre to see one guy grabbed an old woman and they had to pry him loose from her. Who knows what would have happened to her? Oh, by the way, the man who ate up his friend's face, the man was beyond recognition. Everything was gone. I know he wished he had died. Can you imagine having a gaping hole for a face? Nothing but scar tissue and ripped, just ripped to threads? Yeah, well... That's what we're facing in these last days, you guys. Remember I said there'll come a time where you'll have to lock your doors. You'll have to put bars up in peaceful neighborhoods. Well, now I know why. I didn't know why then. I just assumed it would just be strictly demonic. No, this is <laughs> demon possession through drugs. Wow. Yeah. You guys better teach your kids and your grandkids as much as you can. Because if you don't open their eyes, something else 